Ding. All the way live. Hello, Internet. My name's Boots Rangear. Today is a very special day. Why, today is... <laughs> oh, oh, uh, today is... Wait, uh, what is today? Today is... Garbage day! Yes, today is oh, garbage Oh, I gotta take out my garbage. One sec. <laughs> but on this very special garbage day, I've got a song for you. Garbage day! <laughs> Thanks. Oh boy. <laughs> False start. Stick the okay, landing. Stick good. the landing, boots. <laughs> Garbage day is here at last. Ridiculous have all amassed. With all the talents that they bring to share with you, terrible things. We're raising money for the Southern Poverty Law Center now, and we're doing it all day. It's garbage day. I'm really nervous. <laughs> Should I be selling cotton candy? Second verse! This doesn't make sense. Okay. Just gonna get some water here. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta take a break after that oh, set. That's okay, okay, we're good. We're good. We've got statue fetishes and drug reports, juggalo poetry and hating sports. David Taylor's thoughts on Greenland, rapping with J.W. Friedman. <laughs> Artists drawing every hour, spirits growing gradually sour, all that and much more on Garbage Day. Yeah. <laughs> We're gonna I slow just hour one. <laughs> well, is someone holding a gun to your head? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's me not being very comfortable playing the piano. <laughs> Blink once if you're in trouble, blink twice if you're okay. <laughs> this was all put together by Sinclair. Yeah. <laughs> Apologies. Jimmy Franks is making a choice. Bunny Bread's using a high-pitched voice. Lemon's critiquing CSS. We're all a bit worried about Frank West. Healy's is falling <laughs> off the wagon while Portex imitates a dragon. Nacho Gulag's cat is crying. Victor Laszlo's soul is dying. John is making terrible puns. Isfahan is... <laughs> 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 Um, oh, no. uh, let's see. Oh my oh. god. Tighten the bolts. This is unreasonable. <laughs> Tighten the bolts on this wagon. <sighs> well, that was garbage day, folks. Thanks for coming. What, what am I? What am I? We got it. Bring it together. I can do this. We got it. We got it. It's all fine. It's all fine. <laughs> I, have, I have no problem what going on I? stage, but on the fucking internet, this is, this is high tense. <laughs> Come quite search for Harry Potter, Jack Jack's reference and slaughter. Stog is convincingly British, Bunk Girl's getting slightly skittish. Bozarth, yes, and ding along, and I'm still singing this fucking song. <laughs> uh, I didn't write a very good ending for this song. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Ta -ta -ta. Yay! Yay! Yay, boots! <laughs> now you never have to do that again. <laughs> yeah, it's done. That. Yes, you're right, boots. You never have to do that again. That's as good. far I never as have to do that again, <laughs> you never boots, have lower to your do caffeine that intake. You're taking too much. Everyone... <laughs> that was great, boots. Thank uh, you, hi there, friends. Uh, welcome to Garbage Day. Oh, that's what? Sorry. Garbage Day. That is 24 oh. terrible hours with the F Plus. We are doing 24 segments uh, of uh, of content uh, with a rotating cast of ridiculous every hour. Uh, when we do this, we do this to raise money for the Southern Poverty Law Center. You can donate right now at garbage.live. Uh, garbage.live is uh, is how you want to donate. Uh, go right there, and that uh, takes you to uh, our donate page, which uh, eventually gets funneled back into um, 
into the Southern Poverty Law Center. I have a whole bunch of shit that I want to announce, but I want to announce it gradually because, God damn it, we're here for a reason, and that is to read terrible material. So uh, we'll go through some of our donation incentives at some point, but... I want to first talk about this uh, this document that we have in front of us. Um, and the document that we have in front of us is called Braingasms. Oh. Braingasms. Um, uh, this is a document from uh, a long time. Oh, let's see, 2014, December of 2014, given to us by Draco. Uh, and this is about ASMR. ASMR or autos. Autonomous Sensory Meridian Response. Or um, ASMAR. <laughs> ASMAR, as they call it. Um, so, uh, so, so we're going to just learn a little bit about ASMR and, uh, and about how cool it is to come with that thing. So, so, hey, uh, uh, hey, Lemon. Sorry. Yes. Before, you, before you proceed, uh, we've got yeah. a question from somebody in Twitch whose uh, oh, username great. is Cyan on White, so I can't fucking read what it says. Okay. Uh, asking, does the SPLC endorse this? Oh, that's a great question. Um, I have contacted uh, the Southern Poverty Law Center uh, at various times in this situation, um, and I got a nice note uh, from the Southern Poverty Law Center um, about this, and they said, uh, thank you so much for raising money. I can't believe you're doing this again. <laughs> <laughs> And then in parentheses, obviously, we don't officially endorse this. Yeah. <laughs> um, so, yeah, so uh, this is not officially endorsed by the Southern Poverty Law Center. Uh, but they sue Nazis, and we endorse that. Let um, him kiss the mic. Okay, no, I'm was, going to. Sorry, that was me. You know, okay, okay, all right. Uh, so, uh, let's see here. So, we're going to learn a little bit about ASMR. Do, 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 um, Isfahan. Uh, oh, what? Yeah, so your name is Chris. Oh, I should mention uh, in the room tonight we've got uh, we got Lemon, we got Boots, we got Frank West, we got Isfahan, we got Nashel Gulag, we got Stog. Hi, hi everybody. <laughs> and that's poor Texas drawing you're seeing right there. Um, so, uh, so Isfahan, your name is Chris L D N. Uh, Chris L D N on page two of the doc there, and uh, why don't you tell us about ASMR? What is what is what is ASMR? Okay, <clears throat> my name is Chris Lederhosen, and uh, <laughs> yeah. put it on. Uh, okay, ASMR. Those four letters mean a lot to those who experience it, but leave most others feeling confused and unable to understand just what it is that gets our heads tingling in response Ooh. to certain sounds. Also known as autonomous sensory meridian response, this phenomenon only affects a relatively small group of people. Are you one of them? Yes. Uh, Read this guide to find out. Okay, well, how exciting. Yeah. Okay, what is it? I hear you asking. Yeah, sure. ASMR is a relaxing, tingling sensation that starts at the top of the head and can extend mm -hmm. through the limbs. It can be mm -hmm. broken down into two types, A and B. And, and O. No, it's not. Type A ASMR occurs by using only your mind. The sensation is consciously controlled and set off by certain thought patterns. Type okay. B, however, is yeah. much more common. Shouldn't that be type A then? And is an <laughs> uncontrolled reaction to an uh, external trigger. It's type B because it's so commonplace and bland. It's the beta oh. type. Oh, yeah, yeah. The type A is a, like the go-getter ASMR. Mm -hmm, you know? mm -hmm. Okay. This external trigger is required in order for type B ASMR to occur. These triggers will be explored in greater detail later on this page. Some people Good. do experience both types of ASMR. As for the medical explanation behind this phenomenon, well, there isn't one. <laughs> <laughs> nah, so, this just happens. Don't worry about it. Yeah. Doctor's like, I don't know. <laughs> Though there are quite a few guesses as to what the cause may be, one You're of the more a stroke. <laughs> <laughs> over and over. One of the more popular theories is that during an ASMR session, the person is experiencing a physical consciousness of serotonin being released. Another theory is that it can be caused by endorphins, 
while neither one of these theories may be correct, mm -hmm. they are more realistic than some explanations. For example, yeah. people say that ASMR experiencers have ESP or oh. indigo children. Oh, please. <laughs> please. That's, that's, that's like changing lanes without a turn signal right there. God damn. As of right now, no one knows for sure what the sensation is caused by or what it means. <laughs> <laughs> um uh so there's uh there's some more stuff um about uh about uh asmr that we could learn about um and if we had a little bit more time we could do that um so we have like uh terms like aie or attention induced euphoria or there's another term which is a i o e u <laughs> attention induced <I'm> sorry, euphoria. <laughs> And then parentheses, the notice how it incorporates the vowels. <laughs> yeah. It's like, all, all the acronyms sound like goofy falling. Uh, <laughs> wait, and wait, no, no, no. <laughs> Hey, there we go. Uh, and uh, I just wanted to say, uh, I can't fucking believe that we're just starting off with $340, dollars and thirty-five cents. Wow! wow. I Thanks, am guys. so excited. Thank Strong you so much. Uh, that makes me very happy, and 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 uh, we'll learn more about this as the marathon goes out. But the one thing that I will say right now at this moment is that the top donator for every hour gets a brand new fetish. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Every hour, the top donator will be mailed a brand new fetish. That's all I can say about it right now. Um, but uh, we're going to skip ahead uh, to uh, somebody by the name of Harvard Biker. Um, so uh, that's a so great visual. Dog, that sounds like that sounds like you, Harvard Biker. Oh, I love I love to be at Harvard, and also I love to I also love bikes. Where the fuck is this search button? Sure, sure absolutely. No, I I just <laughs> pasted it in, in Discord right there. Oh, okay, thanks. So your uh, name don't worry, is, uh, edit point. We'll edit that out. Yeah, yeah we'll, we'll just edit, edit that. that. <laughs> we don't we'll forget to. what you saw. Edit point. <laughs> I, would, I have okay. no idea what Portex is drawing, but it looks fun. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, so what do you got there, Harvard Biker? Hi, my name is Harvard Biker, and pleasant tingling, Kundalini. Oh, boy. Okay. This is Kundalini. The pleasant, sometimes euphoric sensations described here are the same sensations that we practitioners of Kundalini yoga experience. The tingling is the result of the transference of energy from the lower chakras, anus, genitals, navel, as in the uh, ships, <laughs> to the <laughs> higher <laughs> chakras. <laughs> the brain, the mind, often ascending through the spine. Research all of the experiences of the practitioners of those who seek a kundalini experience through the Woo! ages have stated and see that I am right. Better still, take a kundalini yoga class near you. Steve Power, kundalini yoga teacher, author, spirit warriors. Sounds like you're sounds like you're making fun of your own thing that you. <laughs> well, I it's postmodern. I am from Harvard, and I do ride a bike, so. And you do yoga. I have a I have a second. I have a additional post to add. Yeah. Okay. Uh, please eliminate of those in the second sentence. It reads better and is grammatically correct without those words. Thanks. All right, great. <laughs> what am I, your great. editor? <laughs> so we're gonna uh, we're gonna skip down to uh, to part two of the document. Part two is called "Hooked." Oh boy! <laughs> Woo! Do, uh, do. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I was about to do the the record scratch noise. Wiki, 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 wiki. Uh, yeah, uh, that is, uh, what, what do we do? Boots, is that, uh, is that $100 equals one umbop? Is that okay? We've got an got an umbop backlog. Wiki, 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 wiki. Uh, uh, <laughs> <there you> go. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, uh, yeah, that's correct. Three hundred dollars. One hundred dollars gets you one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, which Boots has like put in the soundboard under like a secret code so that nobody can accidentally trigger mm Bop. <laughs> accidentally. By the way, the, the screen that you're looking at here of the uh, interface uh, was very laboriously created. <laughs> uh, we spent quite a long time making sure this. Oh, 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 Boots. <laughs> Oh god! Uh, oh, oh no! Uh, uh, Come on, it's your time! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Boots, it's your time. wake up! <laughs> yeah! Wiki, 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 wiki! Remix.
Oh, so good. Uh, yeah, uh, then there's a whole bunch of other uh, interface elements that you'll be seeing uh, down the road. But anyway, um, uh, yeah, so uh, part two of the document is called Hooked on a Feeling. Um, and uh, so I've got some questions for you, Nushell. Mm. Um, okay, so, um, yeah, so um, uh, this is, uh, we are obviously in the most intelligent place in the world. I'm talking about uh, groups.yahoo.com. And, and uh, <laughs> your name is Chris, and I have some questions, but if you just introduce yourself, please. Hello, Hi. my name is Chris. I have always known of my tingles, even had a childhood issue that made me hallucinate and run into a mirror. <laughs> <laughs> what I, at the time, called it a food ache, not understanding the awake dream I was experiencing. <laughs> After some psycho- Do you just add that sentence to, like, everything? Because <laughs> that doesn't have anything to do with what we're talking about. After some psychogenics of my own, at a later time in life, I was able to control the emotional brain orgasms. The emotion I felt was not all always mine. People sad, even movie scenes, made me shiver and feel happy just having those feelings. I want to learn more and do whatever I can to further the new research in ASMR. <laughs> okay, great. Uh, I have some obviously frequently asked questions. I'm sure these are questions you get all the time. Are you a patient person? Yes, but once it runs out, I'm quick to snap. Are you an only <laughs> child? No, oldest. Oh, how fucking interesting. Uh, do you anger easily? No. Do you fall asleep easily? Yes. <laughs> do you transmute those two things? Oh, I'm so... <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, what's your favorite musical genera? Classical. <laughs> Classical. Trap. Electronic. Jazz. Heavy metal. And pretty much if I haven't heard it, I do. Oh, thanks. <laughs> What's your favorite movie genre? Comedy, mind bending, and I'm embarrassed to admit, romance. The mind bending genre. <laughs> yeah. Have you heard of it? Um, uh, have you been diagnosed with a sleeping disorder? Sleep apnea. Okay. Have your parents ever done drugs? <laughs> IDK! <laughs> okay, what abs? Yep. <laughs> um, uh, on a scale of one to five, how bad would you say you worry? One. Okay, on a scale of one to five, how empathetic would you consider yourself? Five. <laughs> okay, cool. Cool, I'm so glad that somebody, um, somebody totally asked all these questions. Yeah. On a scale of one to five, how great a person would you say you are? <laughs> <laughs> oh, fine. Oh. Ooh, wow. That's... All right, Frank West, are we ready for, oh, oh, Experience Project. Oh, you're moving over to Experience Project. I'll, but if you actually go to, and I knew about this, uh, but uh, if you go to experienceproject.com slash anything, uh, it says Experience Project is taking a break. We thank our tens of millions of members for being part of the large community of shared experiences. Experience oh, no. Project is offline right now. Oh, no. Uh, Frank West, uh, we're talking about ASMR in dangerous places, exclamation point. <laughs> <laughs> ASMR um, in dangerous places. <laughs> uh, yeah, and you're uh, Gabby Not Gabby, and uh, what do you got to talk about? One of my earliest memories of ASMR were back in elementary school gym class when we had to climb this really long rope, probably about 20 feet high. <laughs> when I would climb it, the sound of the rope between my hands and its gritty texture made me feel dizzy and set tingles down my scalp and spine. Wow. It actually almost caused me to fall off a few times. But the experience of being up there was so intense that climbing the rope was always my favorite activity. <laughs> okay. Okay. I am just thankful that in my trance-like state, I didn't forget to hold on. Anyway, when my sister told me about ASMR, this memory became really vivid and is one of my fondest ASMR moments. The only oh. person who has positive memories of gym class. <laughs> God damn the, the only person who associates climbing the rope with that sensation. <laughs> oh man, this. Uh, oh wow, this uh, this this document goes in a lot of different places. Um, we are currently on the uh, ASMR forums, uh, and my name is okay. So it's AP, like, but it's the Greek letter T, then E Aptim. with an umlaut over it. 
but uh, Aptian, uh, Aptian. And, and uh, Orgasm from ASMR. Dear inhabitants of the forum, in the vastness of our country, have not found a site where one would normally discuss the topic of ACFID. <laughs> Whatever. So I write here, I want to share with you a recent case. I'm 25 years old. I am a student recently sitting on Zian Yatiyata. Zian Yatiya. Zian Uh I once again had the opportunity to experience the phenomenon of ACFID. I experienced this phenomenon since childhood, but in this case, I did not even know that this phenomenon had a scientific basis. <laughs> well, I did, and that's why my wallet has an ACFID blocker. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, so I was sitting in the classroom, and in the audience came a girl. The audience? The classroom audience? <laughs> Okay. To my brain started this unusual reaction was enough for the fact that she appeared in the audience. When she began to walk and talk to people, I was immersed in a sea of pleasure. ACFID more and more. It was the longest session. ACFID. I really wish I could look this up now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Australian Council for International Development is what. Oh, comes okay. Up. Oh, <laughs> thank you. Thank there you. we go. Why does he? Why does he keep misspelling acid? This is making me angry. <laughs> um, as a result, oh, as I make a. As a result, all over the physical orgasm. Yes, I felt a real orgasm from Australian Council Fiduciary. Uh, what did you say? For <laughs> international Fiduciary. development. Oh, okay. Sitting right in the audience. At the same time, I did not have an erection. <laughs> <laughs> After that incident, I became interested in this phenomenon and the word phenomenon, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> John Travolta I, honestly I forgot which direction the slide whistle went <laughs> I can confidently say that this physical orgasm that I experienced from Australian council fuck in dollars <laughs> fucking dollars much nicer than the physical orgasm from sex I was wondering if anyone had an orgasm from physical Australian things or maybe heard about this case. What does Mr. Gamma say? Uh, Mr. Gamma, that's me. Yeah, that sure is you. Yeah. You mean autonomous, cerebral, <clears throat> incredible dream? Oh. Yeah. Oh. I've had wait, one or wait. Autonomous. Okay, so that would be... Oh, so it's autonomous cerebral fucking incredible dream. It's an awful acronym. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> all, bad all, acronym. all dreams are by nature cerebral. Are you a Republican senator? Like that acronym sucks. <laughs> yeah, I've had one or two of those before, but this is ASMR. Sure. You can absolutely combine the two. Who says you can't feel more than one thing at once? Only the librarians of the internet, and they are everywhere, systematically organizing everything over and over. They never let up. Anyways, thanks for stopping by. Currently, I think the blood pressure may have something to do with ASMR, but I am unsure. <laughs> I have lots of theories. I really yeah, should sure write them out do. proper. Instead of doing my serial killer pin board on the walls of my one bedroom apartment. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so we are currently, man, so many places here. Uh, we are currently on, uh, Nutshell. Uh, mm -hmm. we are currently on the unnamed feeling.blogspot.com. That's the unnam three de fill three three ling.blogspot.com. <laughs> um, and, uh, do you have a theory that you want to share here? I sure do. Okay, great. I have a theory. AI might simulate hair growth. Yay! There's the theory, like the header says, but I think that AIE may well simulate hair growth for those suffering from hair loss. I know this because I've been experiencing hair loss for years now. <laughs> I'm not bald, but I've been thinning over the temples, otherwise known as a receding hairline. It's not too bad, but still. 
I have noticed that over the past few months, since I've been actively trying to experience AIE more often than years before, that my hair has improved a little. Now, I know this sounds preposterous. I mean, how can you tell? And how would it affect your hair? I'm not saying that it directly influences hair growth, but I've had a theory for some time that AIE might simulate blood flow to the head. You see, there's an old trick for simulating blood flow that hairdressers use, which involves massaging the scalp, and more often than not, it creates the tingling sensation that I always carry on about. Oh, Whether Jesus it's Christ. the external or internal oh, simulation, or both, remains a mystery, although it is practiced often by some. Another theory as to why AIE might simulate hair growth is that it has long been suspected that a chemical such as dopamine is released during the sensation, which in turn might promote relaxation and well-being, which could reduce stress, a major contributor to hair loss. Okay, okay. Promote hair growth and slow down the process. Don't take this all for granted. It might be possible. And no doubt I'm going to continue investigating it. <laughs> it would save a fortune in medicine and so on if it is true. Oh, you're a good follicle, aren't you? Yeah. Oh, oh no, you're... I fell asleep listening to ASMR and I'm just like, like I'm out of a, a reject hair metal band now. <laughs> you're a beast. <laughs> Um, so, uh, this, uh, another, uh, another dead website, uh, this was from forums.asmr.fm, so that's <laughs> AFMR Radio. You're listening to ASMR FM. <laughs> I like well, it. For the next hour, we'll be crinkling potato chip bags into the microphone. <laughs> <laughs> the, the, yeah, the, the AM wave would just not support that. Um, uh, so Frank West... Uh, you got Mr. Gamma there in, uh, in part three trigger warnings. And, uh, what are the most common ASMR triggers? Sure. It sounds dangerous, but it ain't. Okay. Triggers are what make people feel autonomous meridian sensory responses. Hmm. Common triggers are themes across many different ASMR videos. Ranging from simple head tingles in response to scratching, shivers down the spine with foreign accents, and lip smacking. Common ASMR triggers. Whispering, scratching, tapping, crinkling, rubbing, rambling, non-coherent <laughs> jargon. Hmm. Foreign accents, lip smacking, smells, probably synesthesia. Swinging pendulums. <laughs> <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> That I don't I, even I don't know what that one okay. is. <laughs> it means wow, I get turned wow. on my grandfather on clocks. West. Congratulations, ASMR. Like, like I don't even know what that is. Nature sounds, rain, water, fire. Watching soothing, soothing common household tasks such as ironing or cooking or folding laundry. Uh huh. Page turning and book readings. Hand fixations and movements. Singing and eating sounds. <laughs> okay. You, you might be saying, "Hey, none of those give me tingles." You may have, you may have anesthesia, which is brought about in many different ways. Some, while not all, reasons known. What? So your argument is, I say, I say, I, I don't get a boner from that, and you say, "Yes, of course, you obviously get a boner from that. You just have amnesia that you forgot that you got a boner from." That. No, no you're, anesthesia. You're anesthetized. And that's, yes. Just, yeah. Wow, I can't say that word either. Prescription drugs are often common anesthetics, which reduces one sensitivity. <laughs> so you gotta get off the drugs to get the same thing. Well, <laughs> try not being doped as it kills women. Okay, we're gonna put you under for surgery, but first we're gonna crinkle these bags over your face for three hours. Big Pharma doesn't want you to have, have ASMR. <laughs> but the man doesn't want you to know. <laughs> The best thing which increases your sensitivity with the brain tingles is brain health. Omega-3s are a very popular fish oil extract, which may also be found in some foods such as eggs. That's why you should smash eggs on your head before listening to <laughs> ASMR. Way ahead of you. <laughs> it is a leading vitamin, which may be taken as a supplement, which in turn promotes brain health and sensitivity. Everyone has their own unique personal routines, which may enhance or prohibit the ASMR experience. The best way one may increase their sensitivity with the tingles is by simply watching more videos until they find the right <laughs> <laughs> Is this one working? No? How about this one? No? This one? Just keep going. Yep. Hi. I wanted, I wanted to just... 
Oh, I just wanted to say something very briefly about the uh, the art stream, which is, first of all, that is powerfully erotic. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> just watching more and more sparkles and drools get added to that perverted <laughs> troll doll is very pleasant. Uh, so uh, that is really fun to look at. And also, Portex's system font is fucking insane. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. do, do, do we know, do, do you guys know what, uh, what Portex is, uh, is doing all the art on? Uh, no, tell me what Portex is doing all her art on. It's right a now. Windows XP virtual machine. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Using technology from 2003. Oh, yeah. <laughs> nice. Wow. That is that is real old school. <laughs> she likes to keep it classy. All scripts in cuneiform. <laughs> all right. Uh, so I'm sorry. What a Wookiee, what did you have? Hi, my name's Grant. I live in the SF Bay area. Oh, yeah. Ooh, that's something I like about you, Grant. I have started watching the ASMR videos on YouTube to try to find out what triggers work for me. <laughs> and I'm finding that some scratching and tapping ones almost work, but no one gets me even close to the sensations I feel when I see my triggers in the real world. The triggers I recognized most are purely visual. Hearing them helps, but it's not necessary. They are colon. People washing their windows diligently with the squeegee at gas stations. Wow, you, you like that sound? <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Do bow, bow. That's a big one for me, especially if they do the side windows. <laughs> Why does it matter? <laughs> How could the side windows possibly sound different? It just does, man. Okay. Maybe to an untrained ear like yourself. Hmm. Mm. Over taping shipping boxes with packing tape. The more tape, the more I get a trigger. <laughs> <laughs> Polishing just about anything, but works best when done almost compulsively. Painting or sketching with repeti repetitive motions, like drool or sparkles. <laughs> Wow, this drool, guy yeah. really okay. loves well, then Ross. We must be really enjoying this drawing. Mm -hmm. Congratulations on your boner. Thank you. <laughs> uh, and then the Stog, uh, your name is Anonymous. Anonymous. Oh, asmruready.tumblr.com. Uh yeah yeah yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. This is we're doing the SMR hour, and we're supposed to go like. Are you ready for this? ASMR jock jams. I like to move it, move it. The whistles go whoo. Yay yay. Anyway, my name is my name is Anonymous, and oh, in dear. the movie, in the movie material, Fuck, now it's like a Yin Yang Twins <laughs> album. <over here. laughs> in the movie Material Girls, there is a scene where Hillary Duff was giving her sister a spa treatment, and the scene begins with the tapping of a mortar and pestle. I think I would restart the scene over and over and over. Then I bought a pestle mortar. And I was disappointed when I found that my tapping it couldn't summon tingling feeling. Uh, all right. He over whispered. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so usually when that happens on a recording, we just pretend like you said something funny. <laughs> yeah, yeah, just use whatever his local thing was. <laughs> yeah, and then use whatever your local thing was. So yeah, again, we'll uh, I want to talk to you about the Society of Sensationalists. Can I? Okay. No. Uh, well, okay. Sorry, <laughs> you're not allowed in the society then. <laughs> Shit. Um. Uh. I coined the term. Oh, my. Sorry. My name is Deb Duds. Uh. I coined the term privately. Did not share it with others. Brain chills to describe the sensation I was feeling since I was a little girl. I am now 54 years old and still looking for answers. Until now, the only other person I knew who experienced this was my sister, and she is now deceased. When I told her about my brain chills, she said she experienced them as well, and now we always refer to them as brain chills between us. Uh, here are some movie scenes that I watch from time to time in order to get the sensation I need. <laughs> Something to help me sleep, lol. 
Uh, there is a scene in Butch Cassidy and the Sundance Kid when Butch and Sundance are trying to get jobs in South America. The man hiring them is the trigger. And not Paul Newman. Seriously. Wow. Wow. The scene in Fargo in the all-you-can-eat restaurant where the police chief is filling up her plate from the smorgasbord, and especially when she looks over the information the other cop brings her. I set my DVD on repeat so that I can listen to this over and over. <laughs> I've never seen Butch Cassidy. I've seen that scene many times. I'm confused on what you lo- like. Is it the plate clanking sound? Is that what it is? Yes. It's okay. the plate clanking and like people concentrating on things. But like the plate, I can't be that different in that Fargo's. I'm mean, gonna need to go back and watch that scene. Again. <laughs> you need to watch this a hundred times. This is how it begins, Lemon. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Boots, will you take uh, Andrew there, uh, right under me there, Andrew? Uh, he's got a he's got a uh, diamond points list. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, wait, which? Uh, sorry. Uh, Andrew is right here. There's like 12 posts by Andrew here. Okay, thank you. <clears throat> Hello, I'm Andrew. Uh, uh, hey, no. <laughs> sorry. I, I just got an ASMR. <laughs> oh. <laughs> an ASMR. <laughs> um, yes, I came across something amusing on the ASMR Facebook group this week. A topic was started, and it was all about the worst ideas for a trigger video you could possibly have. It started off as top 10, but it has grown beyond just 10. Here are the best ones. Scooping the litter box. Oh. Enema. Oh. Clipping toenails. Oh. Sounds that's, of urinating. Oh, that's the best ones. Yeah, so your one fetish is that ASMR is your one fetish, huh? Yeah. Well, are are well, these, these like the worst ideas? Yeah, these are the worst, these worst ideas. These are the worst ideas for a trigger video. Yeah. I, I like, I'm Andrew and I really like to engage in very pointless uh, processes. Yeah. <laughs> uh, throwing up, shaving yourself anywhere, scratching your nails over a blackboard, someone taking a dump. Don't ever include these ideas in your trigger videos, or it seems as though your subscribers will take a hit. So good to know. Uh, hey, F plus, guess what it's time for? What is it time for? It's time for poetry. Uh, yeah. yeah. All right. Oh. That's woo, 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 woo. right. How poetry? This is ASMR <laughs> poetry. Hello, poetry. Yeah. Wow, poetry. <laughs> Um, uh, so, uh, well, it looks like this one is meant, uh, specifically for you, Nutshell. So, uh, oh, this no. is a poem by, oh, what was the name again? The name is Chelsea Cat. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> Ch- Chelsea oh. Cat has a, uh, has a poem called, Do All My ASMR Homies. <laughs> the teaser, right. buy one, get one free today. <laughs> Goose pimples in my mind. It starts in my brain. Tingle, tingle, tingle. Right down to my legs. It tickles my spine with an overwhelming sense of calm. How long will he keep reading? I hope he doesn't move on. Tingle, tingle, tingle. Good, good. Yeah, so two verses, five verses. Tingle, tingle, tingle. Okay. (laughs) (laughs) No, I will not. Inside the crown of my head, the sensation, I can't explain it. It's cerebral. Stead- steady, intent pace with your distinct dialect, rhythmic and soothing. I can feel your voice vibrating down my neck, soothing and tranquil, the precise way you communicate. It's as if time stands still. This is terrible poetry. Wow, yeah. what what is, terrible? is there a specific thing you don't like about it? It's awful! Oh, oh, okay. Slow accent, distinctive speech. It's so distracting. Listening Mm. while she speaks. Tingle, tingle, tingle. Happy little tree. I could watch one episode or maybe two or three. The deliberate concentration, the soft touch. I could watch you shop for hours. 
grasping the dress between your finger and thumb, mm -hmm. the way you stare as you contemplate your purchase, I should stop gazing, but then the tingles will disperse. Tingle, tingle. <laughs> oh my God. Did you, I think this is like four poems in a blender. But wait, yeah. there's more. Oh, why? <laughs> Inside my nerves, that soft doctor's voice, speaking those intentional steady words. What did you say? I guess I'll never know. It's hard to concentrate while this feeling grows. I feel like a creep, so creepy and obscured. I don't mean to be this pleasant gift. This unexpected treasure is largely misunderstood. Tingle, tingle, tingle. <laughs> No, tingle, not even. Tingle, not even. Tingle, not even. Just like, I am just... old Chris Kringle. <laughs> <laughs> just I like, there is a refrain, and every once in a while it happens. <laughs> Fuck. God damn it. I bet the next poem will be better. <laughs> <laughs> sure. The, ne the next poem is called ASMR. <laughs> Good. <laughs> and it's by, okay. by old Glenn McCrary. <laughs> oh, <out of> there. <laughs> I'm old Glenn McCrary. Live down by the creek. I'm going to gotcha, read your poem I thought of while Whitland. Glenn, I like your work on the Battlestar Galactica soundtrack. <laughs> That's a reference. Oh, Thomas, <laughs> That's an impossible Meridian reference. response. It is quite a mysterious origin of such pleasure. Common is the multiculturally adopted belief but large fractions of massive populations. <laughs> Hello, poetry! This is a poem. <laughs> 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 Label themselves as insomniacs. If anything, this newfound viral sensation may very well exist to cure insomnia. I'm not sure you know how Blank verse works. $5 it's got words. line breaks in sure it. Do. Just, it words. $5 you just type words. for a while, hit the enter key. Five dollar words. That's all that's what poems are made out of. It has returned a lot of return line breaks returned, so yeah, it's poetry. poetry. Shake and bake. <laughs> ASMR comes in a variety of different sounds that help to release melatonin and aid the body in sleeping. This is fun textbook poetry here. <laughs> Such sounds well, include an audible, an, an audible whisper, gum chewing, table scratching, match lighting, <laughs> ear to ear whispering, tapping, rushing, crinkling. God. <laughs> These sounds are beautiful, inventive, groundbreaking, and a relevant discovery. It's <laughs> a poem <laughs> within the continuous cycle that is known to us as evolution. <laughs> <laughs> I'm surprised he doesn't go into what evolution is at this point. <laughs> the vast majority of us have talking brains. Some of our brains talk more than others, resulting in sleep deprivation on numerous occasions. The dictionary defines sleep deprivation as... Yeah. yeah. Hey, look, listen, man. I have one trigger for these 24 hours. Please do not mention sleep deprivation. <laughs> <laughs> really, we need somebody playing the bongos after every line. I think that would... Yeah. Don't mention that. Um, panic attacks or coming on figurines. <laughs> Can do. Thank you. We've been given a unique sensational gift that aids those in times of misfortune and grief, that aids those in emotional tribulation. Though it is through this global phenomenon, and it is through these talented individuals, well, I sound like Obama now, uh. <laughs> that we are. To possibly, if not entirely, Congress uh, <laughs> said the <laughs> times a way to persuade peace amidst a callous world. That is what ASMR means to me. Goodbye, poetry. <laughs> Goodbye, poetry. We hardly knew ye. And take your five dollar words with you. <laughs> oh boy. Okay. I get uh, my words from the Dollar Tree. Uh, well, I, um, I like this, uh, I like this chart a lot here. So, uh, so Boots, uh, mm -hmm. in about page, uh, 20 or so in the document, uh, there is a table. Uh, the table is of, uh, Water Whispers request list. Uh, Water Whispers has some requests of some ASMR things that, uh, they would like to see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, they, this is something they wants, uh, YouTubers to do in their videos. Sure. <clears throat> uh, the Water Whispers request list. It's a list of triggering things viewers want these YouTubers to do in their videos. All of them are pretty good. Oh, this, this is the this is the comment from uh, yeah 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 from uh, <laughs> who was it Draco? Yes. Yes. Thank you, Draco. Thank you, Draco. 
Requests. Eating Doritos and Kit Kat. <laughs> Same time. <laughs> request. Requ- that's a request for just question mark. I'm kind of yeah. surprised there aren't Dorito flavored Kit Kats at this point, actually. Mm-hmm. Here's- Hi, welcome back to my Kit Kat flavored Doritos. My YouTube Kit Katos Locos. <laughs> uh, a request for Alien 001s. A video with paint roller sounds. Here's a request for Merv. Is there is the is the video just God damn it, how do you clean this fucking thing? <laughs> it's like, oh oh no, it's dripping. God oh, shit. No, Lemon, it's God damn it, how do you clean this fucking thing? <laughs> I can't believe I have to spend the afternoon painting this fucking room. Oh wait, I am sorry, uh for no reason Victor showed up. Nutshell, I think I hear your cat calling you. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh he left. Bye Victor. Bye Victor. Bye Victor. Bye, Victor. Bye, Victor. Bye, Victor. He'll be back next hour. <laughs> Tommy's producing no, no, an ASMR I I video. Calling you. Hi, Tommy. <laughs> all meowing all the time. Hey, what's up, YouTubers? It's me, Tommy31000, and it's here I am to interrupt the podcast. <laughs> um, a request for Merv video with something that has studs. Something that yeah. has studs. Okay, yeah, here's, okay. here's a request for Oboe Guy 2000. <laughs> <laughs> boop, 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 boop. Uh, sounds describe without actually cooking your favorite Dutch or other international dishes possibly as a role play where you're a waitress describing several menu specials for a customer how specific uh, right, here's a request right. for salched blues Detective, were I interview someone and showing some ASMR triggering evidence? <laughs> That's a meta ASMR. Yeah. It's, so in the video, they're holding up like a cell phone with an ASMR video playing on it. Yeah. But it's the, yeah, it's the interviewing about it. That, a request for Blue Trolls 12311. Zombie. <laughs> Like the cranberry song? song? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, no! That is terrible ASMR! (laughs) What's in your head? (laughs) Here's a request for Derek Roke. Advice about acne. Here's a request for Super Mime. That seems like a bad channel for for ASMR, really. (laughs) ASMR mime. He's so good of a mime that he makes sound. He's gone super mime. Superhero role play. ASMR powers. Uh, what does that power look like? Uh, the <laughs> robbers drop all their bags because their brains are tingling. Listen, this whole stream oh, can get sense. shut down if we start putting out spoilers for the next Avengers movie. Okay. <laughs> uh, my favorite superhero potato chips ha- hands bag, man. <laughs> <laughs> That's the only thing that gets you, isn't it, Stog? Yes. <laughs> Got one trigger. Uh, request, okay, request. Tim and tapping on a wood block boy. <laughs> what's what's the next thing? I, I uh, think for the talk, next thing. For talking super bullet. Exciting. Yeah. Oh, I don't think that's supposed to be written like that. Yeah. No, that's <laughs> the right thing. Mm, I don't know. Definitely, okay. Definitely the words meant. I'm just gonna read what it says. Sorry. Uh, sounds of paper of plastic bag raped around the head. Lonely virus virtual barber shop. <laughs> That poor plastic bag. <laughs> or or paper. <laughs> of paper. Sounds of paper of plastic. Maybe uh, the receipt inside of the plastic bag? Here, oh, yeah. There you go. Here's a request for the E-game, dude. Reiki healing session. <laughs> Fuck that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, here's, a, here's a request for... <laughs> here's a request for many people. Draw my life. You bet. Here's a request for Dahlia. Run my hands through flour. That's the That's plant, the not plant. the yeah. <laughs> cooking ingredient. And then Maybe they mean the skunk from Bambi. And then uh, request for a rec show. Vacuum cleaning on canvas. Oh, I love that painting. <laughs> <laughs> 
uh, Frank West uh, found something that he wanted to share with us, but uh, just before he does, uh, there's something that I wanted to say to you, which is, uh, you may be asking yourself right now, what the fuck is ASMR? I'll break it down to you like this. <laughs> and then Lemon spins his chair backwards. <laughs> Crosses his arms. Wait, was this the one about rap music? I wanted the one about rap music. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah, it is. Okay, cool. Okay, so where did ASMR originate? Rap music, of course. Dr. Dre's music takes the credit for this phenomenon. The origin of ASMR is 90s classic hit hot single, No Diggity by Blackstreet, <laughs> featuring Dr. Dre and Queen Penn. <laughs> Dr. Dre is the inventor of ASMR, and he should really capital trademark it immediately. Here is the lyric from Dr. Dre's version of Dr. Dre's verse on No Diggity, which spawned the ASMR craze. Dr. Dre, giving them eargasms with my mellow accents. <laughs> That's not in the karaoke version. Yes, I figured out very easily because this is one of my favorite songs ever. <laughs> No, Lemon. Lemon, just read what's on the dock. That's <laughs> fine. <laughs> Thank you, Dr. Dre, for overpriced headphones, lying about the release of detox, and spawning something as ridiculous as white folks from the insane asylum of crumpling paper in a camera and being fooled into thinking that it's good for them to listen to it. Damn. All ASMR in a, is in a nutshell in. <laughs> Leave me out of this. <laughs> All ASMR is in a nutshell is. Man, white folks will buy anything and believe <laughs> anything. <laughs> <laughs> That's all. Wrong I was there. on the other side of my room for that. Um, uh, so, uh, Frank West, what did you find? So, um, as it may be known, I do actually listen to a lot of ASMR videos, and I periodically gather the titles of some that I think are particularly good, and Wonderful. I just like to read yes. a certain selection. Yes, please. Yes, please. ASMR, Magic the Gathering Roleplay, Draft Night, Soft Spoken, oh, yeah. Shuffling. <laughs> ASMR, Idiot Vampire Trying to Put Gloves On for 10 Minutes Straight. <laughs> <laughs> Xena ASMR episode three, Strange Days, or Xena gives you a cranial nerve exam. Succulent Chinese meal plus democracy manifest, but it's ASMR. Hmm. Spooky ASMR, hello, the adorable organ harvester. <laughs> ASMR slash fantasy merman roleplay. Strong, firm merman stalks you. <laughs> and finally, ASMR pickle rick eating sounds mukbang. The quality content you subscribe for, I'm pickle rick. Oh. <laughs> wow. Uh, so what, if anything, did we learn from this first hour, F plus? Uh, well, I found my only trigger. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah, that's good. That's good. I'm glad for you. We we've all found a, a possible source of new uh, revenue. <laughs> yeah. You're right. You're right. Actually, we we can't get paid from this thing, but if we if we uh, just pivoted just slightly. <laughs> Oh man, I am so like awake and alert uh, mm -hmm. and, uh, and happy mm -hmm. and, and man, I'm just unbroken by, by documents. This drawing is really wonderful. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. my God, I, it's a tapestry, yeah. a tapestry <laughs> of wonder. I like the mural oh, approach that Cortex has taken here. Uh, mm. Yeah, coming into the next hour, uh, Portex is sticking with us. Uh, as is Boots, uh, Frank West, Isfahan, Nasho Gulag. Star oh, it's the same cast yeah, entirely. Same cast. And, and, uh, <laughs> uh, but, but, yep. but, if you like uh, this lineup, get ready for more of this lineup. Uh, Victor Laszlo will be joining us. <laughs> Yay! Oh, uh, wait, 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 wait. Who is joining us? Uh, the actual real Victor Laszlo. Yay! Yay! Oh, Victor. Oh. Not our Victor's Victor. already here. He showed up already. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> 
Uh, yeah. Um, so so uh, once again, uh, thank you. Uh, we are up to four hundred and forty-eight dollars twenty-six cents. Uh, that makes me very happy, yeah. and we're gonna keep going. Uh, somebody got uh, their new fetish this hour, and that's exciting. Um, and uh, we'll we'll learn more about these new fetishes. We'll also uh, learn more about some other uh, fun giveaways. Uh, but yeah, take a break. Uh, we'll be back in about five minutes. Yeah. See ya. Stay tuned.